Hello and welcome my friend and how are you doing? And today I am planning to show you that what is differences between this original car key and then this aftermarket made in China key. And now I have really excellent examples because this key come from this uh, Toyota's dealership center like in USA and in Europe and this key is even made in Japan this is Japanese and then this one is made in China and there is even copy text that this should be tensos part but I can't believe that this is like fake fake key and now I have used that key like uh, this um, couple of months and that key also like two months and what are these keys differences and these differences they are really interesting and soon you will learn really good information okay and this first information is that when I and you are planning to purchase new key for our truck or then in our car we have to purchase this new key and this key is really from this uh, Toyota's original manufacturer like in USA and when I purchase there was this package I got that my package and there is always this manufacturer's Toyota's genuine parts or Lexus parts logo and there was even text that made in Japan and this is this super quality and there is of course this my trans this uh, keys product code and this key belongs in this Toyota Camry car and then that one this red one this very nice key where is even Denso's logo what is fake and now I am planning to damage this Denso's logo because this is copy copycat fake aftermarket product from China and how I can get that I order this key from China and there is this my letter and this came from, I remember that maybe some ebay.com shopping place. And now when I open, tada! There is this my another key. Can you believe? And this is like, this cost only like two or five dollars. And, and now, as we can see, they are just similar, these bodies. And there is also this inside transmitter in there but this is like this key and I got that my key from China and there is key cell and this cost about couple of I think that maybe one or two US dollars and then I need to visit in this lock smith and they made these signs in that my key this is sign and, and this is from in China and there is no any difference and then these keys cost only now I write I have paper in here and this is this China 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 key and this is like aftermarket after market after market part after market part is this my key and that one also and these keys cost only total cost was something like that this key cost 5 US 
dollars or 5 euros and then plus this my locksmith what makes this dents in this my key it was 15 US dollars or 15 euros and total cost is then sum is 20 20 US dollars okay 20 and this cost like 20 US dollars and of course you might now think that why I have in here this original key and there is only what we can see these differences this back area is different and in this old original old original key this is metal this is metal it's like copper and then there is this densos mark in here but this is really densos key because there is denso name and in this my copy there was also but this is not original densos part but this one is and how I can know that this is densos parts because this came from this plastic bag and, and this is from this Toyota dealership center and it is 100% in USA that these are original parts and the most important thing is that this key cost 200 US dollars and this is interesting original key it cost made in Japan even it cost 200 US dollars that one and this one is only 20 and now the thing that what is difference is that why this is now bad and this is still okay the only thing is that in this original key this is steel this is like Japanese samurai steel and this is then some poor quality Chinese metal and now I have used that key two months only two months and then I noticed that this key is like propeller if you are airplane specialist you can think that hey now you have sprit fire or mustang airplanes propel look this is like in spiral this metallic key this must be directly but now this is like bend it and then I need to purchase this original key and this key is this Japanese samurai steel and as you can see this is just direct and this is the only difference when you are planning to purchase this aftermarket key only 20 US dollars or then this original key what cost 10 times more but remember this key last even I can say that 10 years and now the interesting point if this key lasts like 10 years 10 years is this lifetime lifetime and then this China last two months two months two months versus two months versus ten years which one of these is then better for you if you use like this key like one year and this key cost 20 US dollars and in one year and this lasts like two months 
if we have in one year we have 12 months and that means that we need six and I need like six keys per year six keys per year and that cost cost is then per year cost is then six times twenty one hundred and twenty US dollars per year okay and it is easy 120 US dollars per year because these are so short lasting keys and that means now that that this key cost only per year because this normal lifetime is this 10 years 10 years and this cost like 10 years means that year cost year year cost is like 200 US dollars divided 10 years and this means like now that it is 20 US dollars per year okay and now when we compare this yearly cost it seems that this key cost like 120 US dollars per year and then this long lasting original key it last uh, it cost only 20 US dollars because this is so durable metal and then I like to also show that I have in here tongs that how poor quality metal this aftermarket key is and look now starting point is that now this is striked this key and this is now propeller you can see that it is little bit bendy that area and now this is I can't use anymore that because this is so curve this area and now I can see that what happens when I little bit bend that more because now it is already in that sign in this direction like in that area little bit wrongly and now I little bit bend that more look and how easily it happens and in that way I bend And this is this point, can you see now? What is this aftermarket key's durability? And now it is like even drill, drill pipe. And this is the thing why this metal is so poor when we compare in that original key. And this is, I can use that key like 10 years and then this is this is only two months and now you can of course think that hey you can rotate that back but then it happens so that this goes broken and look it happens so easily I will show that when I little bit bend that in this way soon this goes broken and if this key breaks to my key lock it is then really look look now it is always broken and if this broke to our key lock, then it cost like maybe 1000 US dollars to fix if this key part is inside this key lock. And this happens to you if you use poor quality keys. And now you might think that why I, I don't like to rotate that of course I can cut also this one but this is 10 times harder to rotate and if you think that are they really different you can see this color look this is like silver and this is like copper and this is actually maybe copper copper or bronze material copper is this because it is, this uh, color is so brown but this is like stainless steel and if you think that this can be even same like Japanese samurais this steel 
what are those samurai swords, swords. okay that kind of information and of course last one someone can think that maybe that another one is better quality that one than this one and let's look at how durable is that if I little bit rotate that and look how easily this is now like new small Spritfire fighters propeller look and only thing is this metals quality quality is this samurai steel or copper this is like nice now toy to small kids they can play some small play okay and they looks almost similar but only steel is different and then my friend thumbs up if you have learned something new and you think that this information is useful. Thank you.